if the current liabilities are given to be 2 lakh the current ratio is 2 is to 1 and the liquid ratio is 1.5 is to 1 find the value of stock or inventory so now students in this case current ratio is given liquid ratio is given and we are given current liabilities let us come to the formula of current ratio first current ratio is equal to current assets upon current liabilities now in this question we are given a current ratio of 2 is to 1 this is equal to current assets upon current liabilities which are given to be rupees 2 lakhs by cross multiplying 2 into 2 lakh we get current assets as rupees 4 lakh that means this business has got current assets worth rupees 4 lakhs now coming to liquid ratio we are given a liquid ratio of 1.5 is to 1 so now students the formula for liquid ratio is liquid assets upon current liabilities so i'll just change the names here this is liquid ratio is equal to liquid assets upon current liabilities the liquid ratio is given to be 1.5 upon 1 the liquid assets we need to find so we'll put it as liquid assets only the current liabilities are given to be 2 lakh so again by cross multiplying liquid assets are equal to 1.5 into 2 lakh that is rupees 3 lakhs now students what we have got is current assets which are worth rupees 4 lakh and liquid assets which are worth rupees 3 lakh let us come to the formula of liquid assets how do we calculate liquid assets we all know liquid assets are equal to current assets minus stock or inventories minus prepaid expenses but in this case there is no mention of prepaid expenses so that is assumed to be zero now the liquid assets that we had just calculated were rupees 3 lakhs the current assets that we had calculated were rupees 4 lakhs minus stock shifting the sides bringing stock onto this side it will become positive so the value of stock is 4 lakh minus 3 lakhs which is equal to rupees 1 lakh so students based on, on this information we can say that the value of stock is rupees 1 lakh 